Put your glasses up, put your glasses up, a toast to me. Good day, toasters. As you come in, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you are not subscribed. But definitely hit the like button. It's free, y'all. Yes, it's free. Go ahead and hit that like button. It helps the algorithm. Now, yesterday, my co-host on Tuesdays, the, the Mastery Workshop, it used to be called Phoenix Rising Visits SD. And we've, we've changed that recently. Uh, we brainstormed together and we came up with the Mastery Workshop. We, uh, we go live on YouTube every Tuesday at 6.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. You don't want to miss that. Man, we're covering everything, uh, taboo topics, controversial topics, but it's all about healing. And so, uh, you know, that's what I'm on this earth to do, to, uh, to heal, to learn, to teach, to heal. Uh, that's my thing. So, yeah, every Tuesday at 6.30 p.m. Central Standard Time, the Mastery Workshop, where minds come together. Now, my co-host, Phoenix, she told me yesterday as she was getting the flyer together uh, for the production of our Tuesdays Lives, uh, for YouTube Lives, she said, this is, uh, I gave her a picture, or she took a picture from somewhere, and she said, you look so young on this picture, and that picture is only maybe a week old, and uh, I think she asked me, what, what's the secret, what are you doing, and you know, I'm just, I thought about it. And I'm, I'm kind of doing the same thing, regiment-wise. You know, I've always drank a lot of water. Uh, I've always uh, ate pretty good and uh, got my got my sleep. Uh, I've always, you know, did my, my three-step regiment with my skin, <laughs> right? Uh, wash, uh, exfoliate, uh, astringent, uh, or cleanse, and uh, moisturize. I guess that's four steps. But uh, I've always done that. So I'm big on taking care of myself from within and out. But as I thought about it, you know, I've always, uh, well, I've never looked old. I've never looked old. But I think in that picture, and maybe most recently, I started looking younger because a few years ago, I learned something very important, and that is to release the things you cannot control. Uh, yeah, I was stressing, uh, and I won't go into the situation, but yeah, I was stressing over a situation, which is in the book, but I think it was aging me. Yeah, I think it was aging me really fast. Uh, and so, man, I got, I got to a point where I said, I got to release this, you know, it ain't worth my help. No one's worth my help. And I start practicing that in life to release things I cannot control, stop pushing people to do better, stop wanting uh, or seeing the best in people and wanting them to reach the level you think they can reach. Uh, I got to stop doing that. Uh, I got to stop uh, pressing and stressing over anything outside of me that's out of my control. And uh, I learned that, that valuable lesson a few years ago to let things uh, flow around you, uh, flow through you, flow away from you, or flow to you. Yeah, that's an important lesson I learned. So, man, I don't stress. I don't stress. Uh, nothing really can get under my skin. Uh, you know, I had to address an issue uh, this past weekend at a restaurant. Horrible service. Horrible service uh, from the beginning to end. Horrible service. And then, on top of that, they added stuff to my ticket that, that uh, didn't belong. But uh, I addressed the issue with, with the young lady, the waitress, and the manager. But I was calm. You know, I was calm, uh, which I typically am, you know, throughout my life. It takes a it takes a lot to get me riled up, you know. Uh, they don't, that doesn't mean I hadn't put hands on people in a calm manner. I have put hands on people in the past in a calm manner. Like, it was just the principle of it. I, I had to discipline you. Uh, but to really get me riled up, it takes a lot. Um, but, uh, yeah, I was calm, man. They ended up <laughs> uh, giving me my, my whole meal free. And so I didn't even want that. I just wanted it, wanted it corrected. 
And uh, but uh, yeah, but I don't let anything stress me. Uh, yeah, I don't uh, I don't forecast. I don't anticipate uh, bad things. I just let things flow, and it's worked out. You know, it's worked out. I put my best foot forward, and made the chips fall where they may. And so, uh, that's how I live life, man. And I found out when you do that, things will either come together in harmony, or they will separate in harmony also. But either way, you win. But yeah, man, don't don't take years off of your life stressing over things you have no control over. Uh, speak positivity, yes. Affirm positive things in your life and move in a positive way. Move in a prayerful way in life. But uh, yeah, don't let things affect you. Keep a clear mind, clear spirit, clear heart, pure heart. And just keep it pushing. You know, it's just not worth your health. And you'll start seeing the, uh, the, the, the positive effects when you stop stressing, when you stop worrying about things. Just let things flow. I promise you, you'll have a better life. As always, from me to you, love. Peace.